we, we made choices of where to lay down our roots. Um, and maybe we gave up potential um, of you know, having a house in the suburbs or whatever folks may think is, is a sacrifice. I don't really identify with the fact that we made sacrifices. That is that we gave up a greater thing for a lesser thing. Um, because I do really believe in, in the scripture. I've really seen it uh, played out that uh, where Jesus promised his disciples that uh, any, you know, I will return any houses and lands and anything that you sacrifice for the kingdom of God, even in this life, I will return that. And I've experienced that. So um, I don't know if I even had the capability of being a business person and getting a membership for a country club. That was never tested. I never can say I gave that up. Uh, so I don't even know if I'd have been successful uh, doing that. Uh, but that seems really paltry to me uh, for what I've received. I mean, I've, got, I've had the opportunity as a young man to kind of receive this vision from God that, um, of being involved in this transformational journey of myself and uh, of this community. And I've been in, my wife and I, family and friends, have been able to invest ourselves into this. Uh, and we've seen uh, fruit of that. So this dream of a young person we've seen come true, as flawed and as mistake-ridden and as imperfect as it may be. But we've seen that, tr that dream come true. There's not a lot of people that dream dreams as young people uh, that see that happen. A lot of times people give up on those dreams uh, or don't see it happen. Um, so I think while some people may see it as a sacrifice, we don't see it that way. We, we see it as that, that we've really been blessed, that we've been able to invest our life uh, and to see a return on that investment. I heard once that there was this study done of 95-year-olds and they asked them uh, if they had their life to do over again, uh, how would they approach life differently? And uh, there were three common responses. They would take more risk. They would invest their life into things uh, that really matter. Uh, and that they would invest their life more into relationships. Uh, and I, I think that's very instructive. Uh, invest your life into something that really matters. I also heard somebody say at the end of the day, they, they don't think on the dying bed there was ever anybody who just wished they could do one more deal. So in, investing your life where it matters um, I think is its own reward.